Greenville ISD is ready to start the new year with robust instruction to enhance learning and safety and cleaning precautions to keep students and staff safe. For more than 100 years, we've been in the learning business, and we've helped our graduates prepare for success in college, career, and the military. Whether it's online or in person, we're here to teach our students. We're here for our families, and we're here to stay. If we look back at what we have prepared over the summer, a lot of teachers have been working really, really hard to get a plan that would fit all of your child's needs. I know in under normal circumstances, we would all say we want our kids to be at school, but these are not normal circumstances. And although we hope we get there again, um, right now we have to do what we have to do to continue in education for our children. Starting school back up in September, we have had some time to prepare. GISD has a wonderful group of educators that are going in and working to prepare a good method, whether it's through online or in the classroom. And uh, we are going to take all the necessary precautions to make sure that your child continues to learn in the safest way possible. So I can assure you as an educator and as a former GISD student that your child's safety and education is our number one priority. Whether it's remotely or in the classroom, we will do everything in our power to continue uh, that rigorous learning and to continue to prepare them for our world. Last year when we shut down school, things got pretty tough on us as far as educating your child. We had uh, the online that we were trying to do and then we had the packets. So this year, uh, we, were, we had a little time and we were able to put some things together to make this year a lot more successful with hybrid models and online models that now we feel that we're going to be able to put our kids in position to be successful. I've been with Greenville for 11 years. Started out as a teacher at Carver Elementary and was a Carver Cool Cat. And here at Greenville ISD, we know that a robust uh, online learning program requires a robust infrastructure. And for that reason, we have been working diligently this summer to uh, develop a platform that works for both students, teachers, and families. This summer, we've been working to add public access Wi-Fi to each campus. We are adding webcams to each classroom. We are also adding uh, iPads for every LP Water student. Additionally, uh, by popular request, we are adding Seesaw for pre-K through second grade as an online learning platform. And then we are also building a robust uh, online learning program for teachers that will also include training for parents and students. My name is Noelle Bars, and I'm the Director of Health Services for Greenville ISD. And I want to let you all know that we are taking this pandemic very, very seriously and we are staying up to date on all the steps that we need to take this fall to keep our students, staff, and families safe. Our staff will be required to self-screen and wear a face covering every day. Students will be screened at home by their parents and also required to wear a face covering, first graders and up. We are also very fortunate to have nurses on every campus who will assess students and staff who display symptoms of COVID-19 or illness throughout the school day. Hand washing will be encouraged several times without the school day with both staff and students. We will practice social distancing as appropriate and according to the CDC. There will be frequent cleaning of the campus. Every campus will be cleaned every day and we will have cleaning throughout the day on frequently touched surfaces. We are in constant contact with our health experts in the county. Parents and staff will be informed immediately of any positive COVID students or staff on campus. Anyone with COVID will be quarantining at home via the CDC for 14 days and a letter of good health will be required to return to school for both students and our staff. I have been a school nurse for 22 years. This is my seventh year with Greenville ISD and I am here to stay. I am Crystal Lopez, a fifth grade teacher at George Washington Carver Elementary, a lifelong proud GISD student, and I am here to stay. I am Shannon Falk, and I'm here to stay. And I am Heath Jarvis, and I am here to stay.